Hi friends, a warm welcome to my YouTube channel Shantipriya Grammar Classes. So, sorry for the delay video. In this video, I am going to discuss about the future simple or we also call it as simple future tense or future indefinite tense and future continuous tense. Okay. So, please watch this video till end because it is very important topic. So, please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Those who have not yet subscribed, press the like button. Whatever doubts you have, you can put it in the comment box and share my videos. You can also follow me in Instagram and Twitter also. I'll put the link of Instagram and Twitter in the description box so that you can follow me in that also. Yes. So now what all we are going to discuss in this uh, topic is what is simple future tense with examples? When do we use simple future tense with examples? What is future continuous tense with examples? When do we use future continuous tense with examples? So first let us see what is simple future tense. Okay, Simple future tense, it is also called as future indefinite tense, is used to express an action that has not taken place yet and will take place in the future. That means what it is used to express an action which will take place in the future. See the example here, Billy will play soccer after one hour. So it is after one hour he is playing, it didn't happen. Okay, It will happen in the future. There is no planning or intention in the future sentences used in the future indefinite tense. Let us see the examples here. Sarah will be a mother. Winter will come again. Will Jessica see that woman in your school? We will live in the different city. Will they learn English next month? Will we come to see in us in winter? Will he make a cake on Monday? Yes. So now let's see the usage of simple future tense. When do we use simple future tense? Okay. A simple future tense is used for actions decided at the moment of speech. Like if we take here, I have a toothache. I'll take some medicine. Now I have a toothache, so I will take some medicine immediately. Next, for unplanned future actions. Winter will come soon. It's an un unplanned future action. For offering, asking for a request, promising, ordering or threatening. So when you offer something, or when you ask for a request or when you are promising someone or when you are ordering something or someone or when you are threatening someone like let us take the example i'm afraid we will get wet for unpreventable actions in future that means what which will not be prevented in future like summer will come soon so it will come soon there is no prevention for that next with unconditional time and purpose clauses like examples here, when I arrive at home, I will call you. Okay, next. For thoughts, predictions, assumptions, surenesses, fears about future. Like if I take, I promise I won't tell this to anyone. So you are sure that you won't tell this to anyone. For that also we use simple future tense. Now let's see what is future continuous tense. Future continuous tense indicates an action that will occur in the future and continue for a period of time. For some period of time, this future action will continue. So for that sake, we use future continuous tense. See now, like uh, examples if you see, it will be storming tomorrow. Next, it is for affirmative sentence. Next for negative sentence, it will not be storming tomorrow. Next for question, will it be storming tomorrow? Yes. Now let us see when to use future continuous tense. So future continuous tense is used to describe interrupted actions in the future. Like if you take example, when you come tomorrow, they will be playing tennis. Okay, that is interrupted action in the future. Next, to express actions in progress at a specific time in the future. That means what at particular time, what action will be taking place. Like if you take example, at 12 o'clock tomorrow, we will be having lunch at school. That means what? It will be happening there at that specific time. Next, to refer to actions that are happening now and expected to continue in the future. Like unfortunately, sea levels will still be rising in 20 years. Okay. Next, to ask a question politely about the future. Will you be bringing your friend to the party tonight? Next, to emphasize future plans and intentions. He'll be coming to visit us next week. Next. To describe atmosphere in the future. When I arrive at the party, everybody will be celebrating. Some will be dancing. Next, to express parallel actions or series of parallel actions in the future. She will be watching TV. 
and he will be cooking dinner same time it will be happening happening what is that she will be watching tv at the same time he will be cooking dinner okay so with this i am going to end today's pick so please don't forget to subscribe my channel press the like button whatever doubts you have you can put it in the comment box and share my videos i'll put the link of instagram and twitter in the description box so that you can follow me in that also thank you very much